definitely a crazy video. A little disconcerting to see. Hopefully it's the end of it. Shocking video and sound of concern coming out of Richmond's Churchill neighborhood tonight after ring doorbell video, as you just saw, captures what looks like someone slashing tires and running away. You're watching 8 News at 6. I'm Deanna Albritton. And I'm Heather Hope. In for Eric tonight, this all happened early Monday morning, and now residents are sharing their reaction. 8 News reporter Roland Wilson joining us live in studio now, and rolling some crazy images there. That's absolutely right. Certainly not something you see every day, and it's not what one Churchill neighbor tells me he expected to see when he went through his ring camera video. He's hoping sharing will prevent this from happening again. A quick burst of air and then a quick escape for one person in this Churchill neighborhood early Monday morning. The situation coming as a shock for Drew Pyrak after his ring camera caught what looks like someone slashing the tire of a truck parked right in front of his home. It's not what I expected. I was up uh, running some errands in the morning and I saw the flat tires. I, I texted my neighbor and I said, hey, your truck has a couple flat tires. Is this a new development? That's when he offered to check his ring camera to see what happened. I wasn't expecting to come across anything, but you know, I spent about an hour sifting through and saw some pretty clear footage of this guy slashing tires. The video starts shortly after one Monday morning. You see someone wearing a dark hoodie come from the left side of your screen on the sidewalk. After stopping at the black truck parked in front of Pyrax home, the person approaches the driver's side. Soon after, you hear what sounds like air escaping the back left tire. And then the person runs away before coming back about 15 minutes later. Then yet again, another burst of air. I'm not sure if it's just some guy with a pension for mischief or if it's something a little bit more targeted. Um, hopefully not the latter. The tire remains flat today and Pyrax says his neighbor is working to get it fixed. In the meantime, he says he submitted the video to Crime Stoppers. Just so that it maybe doesn't happen again. Um, if people see that Maybe they're being recorded, something could come of it. Maybe it increases the risk for them and their decision making and they decide not to slash tires next time. I reached out to Richmond police to see if they're looking into this, but I haven't heard back at this time. In the meantime, Pyrak hopes this will serve as a reminder for neighbors to look after one another.